think the important message, message is that you know there's a lot of interest in the signaling CAR T cell therapy, a lot of excitement in the past, but they may you know that there are some concerns, rightfully so, associated with it for the toxicity. I think important thing is to think about this therapy early. Um, so you know they may not be right therapy for all of uh, all the patients with the relapse in ALL, and then we do have uh, some options for B relapse B ALL uh, as well, bilinitimumab, inositumab, just being one of them, and there are the clinical trials that's available. So there's a lot of factors to go into. So, but the important thing is to think about this therapy early, consult early. So if you're at the center, they're not administering CAR T cell therapy directly, but you want to think about those patients, consult them early because that even if they may not be the right patients, that by consulting, they may, you may get some suggestions in other ways. And then if that is the right therapy where the patient needs to go, it may impact what the next immediate therapy or the bridging, what bridging therapy, the best option to allow that patients to get to effectively and then receive CAR T cell therapy uh, safely. So there are a lot to go into and kind of in the busy practice and then when and, and ALA is a rare disease so we really do encourage reaching out all of us are really available for those happy to help uh, and for our patients if we don't have a CAR T cell therapy clinical trials available we also do know that what other centers may have because it's a relatively small field so we can also help you get connected with to other experts nearby in the areas in other parts of the country uh, that choose the right therapy for our patients.